Welcome back. Today's video is going to be talking about how to work your favorites list within NextGen, which probably is going to be an important thing for you guys once ICD-10 rolls around. So you got a few ways to do it. Within your favorites list that you have here, you can always use this filter option to kind of sort through diagnoses. Other than that, when you're in diagnosis code lookup, you have an area to your left side here marked favorites and you can use this plus sign to add in a new favorites list or this is where you can come to consult your lists that you've been building in the past. Say for example I want to search for a new diagnosis so we'll say diabetes. I can right click the diagnosis and then add to favorite group and whichever one I want you can throw it into. So I'll put it into Bobby, then mark select, do the whole add update, and you'll see it now appear here within my favorites list. The other way to do it that we've discussed in the past revolves around searching for your code, pressing select, then coming to add to my favorites and then you can use the drop down menu to then choose your favorites list to add it into. And that's essentially all the ways that you can work the favorites list. So once again, go to diagnosis code lookup, go to your favorites list and use the plus sign to create custom favorite lists. Otherwise, when you search a new diagnosis, remember to just right click it and then add it on in. The other way is once you have your information populated within the middle here, just remember to click off my favorites and then assign it to your own group. All right, and that concludes today's video. Thank you for your time.